I ended up writing a small book on Amazon. It was it, it had Amazon bestseller. It, it's it has 123 references. The TBI is traumatic body injury, but nobody looks at that. Everybody looks at oh, I have a headache and I have that, and that's all real. It's the long term residuals that are that are the nightmares. That that that's what you got to address. You got to you got to put the fire out while it's little. Um, is there? Yeah, is there such thing as grades of concussion or is a concussion a concussion? Like we used to hear the term, it's a minor concussion or it's a severe concussion. Is a concussion just a concussion or are there different degrees of damage done via concussion? Okay, two great questions. First of all, there's I'm going to categorize concussion in two big categories. Your brain is a bucket. There is a thing called a subdural hematoma where you basically have a swelling and ruptures of arteries that's the big concussion. Oh, crap. Emergency room. They have to take the pressure out. Otherwise, you go home, you take a nap, and you don't wake up. The other, it, and you're, you're using another phrase, a concussion. I tell people it's not a concussion. It's your 25th concussion. Why? Well, 80% of the kids before age one fall on their head per the CDC status. Remember three years old when you and your brother were playing in the backyard, you bumped heads, and you saw stars? And then number seven, when you fell off the swing set? And eight years old when you fell off your bike, and 13 years old when you did something else stupid, and, and 18, and that, 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 that. And now this is your 23rd and 24th concussion. Yeah, maybe you're not blacked out and you can't see things, but that trauma is cumulative. And it's not, it, yes, those are concussions, but really it's head injuries, it's, it's head bumps, 